we are gearing, preparing for ASEAN integration, and so therefore, we have to um, maintain the momentum of mm -hmm. the gains that uh, we have already achieved, as uh, mentioned in the report a while back. We don't expect um, much that is new in this book. We, we felt that as we approach 2015, mm -hmm. we should have a handy reference on ASEAN, something mm -hmm. that ordinary people can refer to. So this is not for the specialist. Mm -hmm. yeah. okay. uh, we feel that that part is taken care of by articles and papers mm -hmm. in specialized journals. So mm -hmm. we, we, we thought uh, we needed to do something for the ordinary. I, I think uh, yung nakikita nating problema dyan, eh yan din yung nakikita, nakitang problema ng mga European nations noong magsimula sila sa Euro. Uh, sa Euro. Kasi kung tutusin, kahit na magkaka, magkakalapit, magkakadikit yung mga, mga, mga countries ng European market at mayroong mga common histories na kung tutusin. Right now, ang, ang the N NCR alone, we have assisted uh, about 17,000 firms mm -hmm. in the NCR. Mm -hmm. Nationwide, we have about ma more than 200,000 firms. Mm -hmm. So isn't it nice that government is doing it for them? Yes. Policies and programs that governments and higher education mm -hmm. institutions adopt Mm -hmm. to respond to globalization. Okay. So you are internationalizing, not just because there is integration in the region, mm -hmm. but because education is well already globalized now. Mm -hmm. So the ASEAN Coordinating Council is composed of the foreign ministers of the ASEAN member states. Okay. And they also have uh, uh, to sign an accession mm -hmm. to the instrument, to, okay. uh, to the charter, so, so the ASEAN charter that they have uh, ratified.